Now let us look at the most exciting feature of this software that is case diagnosis. Here you can see the case number, the patient name and the disease name and the date when the last disease was saved for that particular patient. Double click the case number and you can change the patient name. Here let us diagnose the case. For example, we will search the word in dermatology chapter. Here you can enter the word that you want to search and click search and it will display all the diseases where these words occur. Now clicking on the description panel you can see the preview where the words occur in that particular disease. Now when you click the detail it will tell you the description of that particular disease, the investigation to be done in that particular disease and the management. Now if you are not satisfied with what has been told here, you can click for more details and it will take you directly to our website which is powered by Google's search engine and you can satisfy yourself. Now if you are satisfied that this is the case for your patient and if you add by selecting the disease it will appear on main screen where it will be saved for your patient. Now if you want to see the details of a particular disease just click the disease diagnosis button and it will take you to the form where you can search the disease name. Here for example you can browse through thousands of disease and when you click on a particular disease it will tell you the description investigation and the line of management for that particular disease. Now this is uh, another example to understand how this search function works. Here when you enter pain and fever and take another or vomit and say search by pressing enter or clicking search button. The list of diseases where pain, fever or vomiting appears is something close to 156 diseases. Now when you click on the chapter pane or the description pane you will come to know where these keywords appear. Now if you want to do an advanced search if you feel that the words that you have searched for should be in the same line or you can search it in the same paragraph. Now, when you click that the search text should be in the same line you can see the list of diseases has squeezed down to 8 diseases now you can see here for example the word pain, fever or vomit has appeared in the same line in renal calculi this is one such example where you want to search it in single line. Now take the case of search in the same paragraph. The disease list has grown to 18 numbers. Here you can see that the three words appear in the same paragraph. Now you can go back to the basic search. Now we will select a chapter, say for example gynecology and say done and we will change the search words. Now you can see this particular words appear in a chapter in only two of the probable diseases and you can click details and it will tell you the details as we have already told you before.